Okay, so I don't have any kind of editing software. I'm going to be posting this to YouTube later just because I want to. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Mason Sucks at Unboxing Videos. That might have been backwards. I don't know. I got my cryptids today, and I'm very excited. Girls. Um, I have cats. Um, this is Toaster. And this is Pancake. And they like to be in the middle of everything. Toaster. Toaster, I have a knife. Can you please, like, not? Oh, cool, they sent me a thing. Entertainment Earth. That's where I got this from. I got it from Entertainment Earth, but I literally just got it because it was the cheapest place to get my Kripkins. Yeah, you, oh, you want the box? Here, have the box. Over there, look. And all the paper. Because why would you ever care about anything else besides the box and the paper? Okay. Oh, and this is tangerine. I've got four cats. We probably won't see Mocha, but these three will definitely be in and out. you still. So they've got 12 in here. At least, yeah, it was supposed to be 12. And yes, there are 12 because it was an entire case, and I just built the little box myself. Okay. So I've got 12 of them here, and I'm very excited because when I went to Hot Topic, they only had three, and that was like several weeks ago. And every time I've gone back to check if they've restocked, they don't have any. Yes, I know, it's a box. Please leave me alone. Okay, so, Kripken number one. And they come with like they come with the card that tells you who they are if you don't have any idea who they are, because I usually sometimes don't have any idea who they are. I do know who this is because I have him already. This is the Chupacabra. El Chupacabra, El Chupacabra. Yeah, I'm I'm a nerd. And I'm gonna open his card just because I know. If I don't open it now, I might forget later. But yeah, Chupacabra. I'll put him back in his box and I'll put him in the big box. Okay, number two. It is also Chupacabra. Wonderful. Gonna open his card as well. Because, you know, like I said, probably forget if these all end up being Chupacabra, you'll probably see me cry on camera. Okay. 
the ones I have are Bigfoot and Chupacabra, and I got the Jersey Devil, and I gave it to my fiance. Yes, I'm opening these with a knife, just because I want to. Okay. <gasps> it's Cthulhu! It's him! It's Cthulhu Tang! Tang, look, it's Cthulhu! Can you mean? Come here. Come here. Pancake, look, it's Cthulhu. Oh, Pancake, it's Cthulhu. It's my big snake boy. I'm very excited about Cthulhu, if you couldn't tell. Um, the one that I'm really hoping to get is Mothman, because I really, really like Mothman. Okay, Cthulhu's going back in his box for now. And we're putting him right there. When I saw the green, I was a little bit worried that it was another um, chupacabra, and I was was about to be big mad. Okay. It's a Jersey Devil. Like I said, I know because I already have the Jersey Devil, and I gave him to my boyfriend. Okay, and I've got the Jersey Devil card, and I've got him in there as well. This is number five. It's another Cthulhu! Cthulhu! I'm excited about that because that means that I can definitely give one either to my boyfriend or my cousin who also collects them because he said to keep him in mind if I got any doubles so he's gonna be in there I'm really hoping to get a mothman in this round because I bought 12 of these guys and all of them have been green boys and the Jersey Devil this is number six. Toaster, please. You're blocking the camera. Toaster. <gasps> it's the Loch Ness Monster. It's Nessie. It's Nessie. I'm, I'm so excited about this. It's Nessie, guys. <laughs> I'm so excited about Nessie. Um... I'm gonna take a break and I'm gonna actually read her card because, come on guys, it's the Loch Ness Monster. Like, we we have to, I mean Cthulhu is pretty great, but like the Loch Ness Monster. Uh, her name is Nessie. Legend suggests she may share some DNA with large dinosaurs. You don't need to look at some grainy photo to tell that she's for real. She might be small, but she could keep growing and growing. It might be light, smart to locate all major bodies of fresh water, water of fresh water close to you now, so I can move her when she gets too big. She's an omnivore who prefers salmon, sturgeon, minnows, and varieties of zooplankton. Her habitat and range is the Loch Ness Lake in Scotland. Yes, it is. Are you gonna pounce on your sister? Is that what's going on here? Probably. Can I put this back in the box? Okay. Y you good? I'm gonna keep opening around you. Okay, this is number seven. No, don't eat the knife toaster. <gasps> it's the, um, I think it's the night crawler. I'm gonna open his card to make sure. Because I think that's what it said online. Yeah, Nightcrawler. Um, about four feet tall is what they say about him. He may look strange and make your neighbors believe aliens are invading. This little creature is friendly as they come. Folklore suggests he may have evolved to survive on a planet with swamp land. So it's a big bonus if you never live if you live any, near any wetlands. 
Fresno, California, and Yosemite National Park. Now, I've never heard of you, little dude, but you better believe I'm going to take great care of you. Okay. My cousin ordered one, and he got the Thunderbird. I mean, when you're hoping for Mothman, kind of sucks, but hey, I like Thunderbirds. Speaking of Thunderbirds, <laughs> it's Thunderbird. <laughs> That's right as I was talking about him. Maybe I should talk about Mothman for the next four and see if I get any Mothman. <laughs> that would be hilarious. But yeah, it's the little Thunderbird. He, um, I know mostly about Thunderbird from J.K. Rowling's Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. North America, I think he's from um, Native American mythology. I'm not entirely sure though. Look at him, he's so cute, he has the big red eyes. Okay, and that was number eight. Now we're moved on to number nine. Mothman, 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 Mothman. Oh my god, it worked. Oh my god. Oh my god, it worked. It's Mothman! It's Mothman! It's him! It's him! I said Mothman the entire time I was opening it, and it was him! Oh my god, I'm so excited about that. It's Mothman. It's Mothman. It's Mothman. Okay, that was hilarious. I'm gonna try not to jinx any of the rest of these, but like the Cosmic Cthulhu would be nice. Right, don't you think? Cosmic Cthulhu? I'm gonna try to jinx this one and see if it's a Cosmic Cthulhu. That would be amazing. I highly doubt it, but you know. Oh, it's the Yeti. He's a Yeti. Don't eat him, Toaster. I know you like to eat things. Don't eat him, please. Please, Toaster. Please, Toaster. Okay, gonna put him back in the box. That was number 10. Okay, here is number 11. It's Bigfoot. Like I said, I already have him, but you know, I can give doubles to my cousin. And hey, I mean, it's Bigfoot. Bigfoot's still cool. Bigfoot is definitely cool. And he's from the Pacific Northwest. A. Okay, guys, last one. Um, I'm going to promise not to be disappointed with whomever it might be. Um, thank you so much if you've watched this far. And we're going to open this little last guy together. I'm actually, I'm going to open him with my eyes shut so that I can't see who it is. And I'll show you guys first. Okay, if he's black, it's another Mothman. If he's white, he's the Twilight Mothman. But we'll see. It's the Twilight Mothman! Oh, that's so cool! I was hoping to see him today. Now, what is the difference between Twilight Mothman and regular Mothman? Is there any? Four feet and 12 feet tall, carnivore, New England. Nope, doesn't say if he's different than regular Mothman. Well, anyway, easy Twilight Mothman. That, that's a great way to end this video. Um, once again, 
Mason sucks at unboxing videos. And um, thank you so much for watching and keep an eye on my channel for more content. Um, I accept any sort of criticism, you know, just whatever. Okay, well, bye-bye.